Hi guys, welcome to a video and in today's video I just wanted to do a review of one of the latest Adventure Time episodes, Obsidian, which is part of a four episode special, partly out of nostalgia and partly out of the very cool representation it offers for very young gay people or very old gay people. So for those of you that have ever followed Adventure Time, you'll know the last season ended with a bubbling kiss, which was unfortunately still quite controversial that two female cartoon characters should kiss each other because it is totally normal, but some people are like, no. But the last season ended with a bubbling kiss, which was very bold of them and very cool. And it was a nice gift to the lesbian community because for a lot of the original seasons of Adventure Time, the romance between Princess Bubblegum and Marceline the Vampire had very much been subtext. So this year Adventure Time came back with a four episode special and one of the episodes was concentrated on Bubbleine and it was very very cute. The episode is called Obsidian and basically Princess Bubblegum and Marceline get called back to the Glass Kingdom to defeat this dragon type creature. What I loved about this episode is there was no more kind of tiptoeing around their relationship. It was very affectionate, it was very cute. The episode itself has lost none of its nostalgia, none of its warmth, none of its humour. It was as though I was watching one of the earlier seasons. There was a kiss, there was good music. I believe King Princess did a cover of one of the songs which is just I, it's like gay layered cake, delicious. And I think this kind of representation is really important in showing kind of domestic lesbian bliss to younger gay kids because, or not even gay kids, like all kids, because really what you were exposed to as a very young person shapes a lot of who you are and your opinions and your perceptions as an adult. And it just makes this world a safer, uh, more welcoming place for gay people. I mean, I know if I'd had this stuff growing up, up, I probably wouldn't have had half the internalized homophobia that I had and still have so yeah. I also liked that we saw some of Marceline's backstory with her mother. It was very emotional and as I say the episode was quite touching in general. Okay guys if you've seen the episode let me know what you think of it in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe for instant disappointment and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!